Hi, this is JP from Nota Lights Over Arkham. Welcome to another playthrough of the uh, Parallel Investigator Dream Eater series. This time we are continuing on the Dreaming side in Scenario 3A, uh, Dark Side of the Moon with uh, Parallel Skids. So uh, we managed to escape the Corsairs last time and uh, got 8 experience uh, and a good chunk of the evidence of the gods so that uh, it will make the last scenario a bit easier. But uh, we got a experience, so let's hop over to ArkhamCDB.com and see what upgrades I did to the deck. Okay, and we are over on ArkhamCDB.com and the uh, only changes I made to the deck were that I removed two copies of Leo De Luca. Uh, Leo is a bit expensive and uh, Instead, we took two copies of Lola Santiago. So Lola Santiago is a really good ally for skits as uh, she boosts um, intellect and agility. Also, because skits has loads of resources, we can exhaust Lola and spend X resources to discover one clue at our location, access the shroud value of your location. So uh, that is another uh, way to get fast clues. So this is a good, good upgrade to to the deck also uh, because kids can upgrade cards that have the uh, gambit or for fortune traits uh, I added another copy of money talks level 2 and did not remove the level 0 version so we have four copies of money talks in different versions in the deck so those were the eight experience I upgraded into the deck. So let, let's hop back over to the scenario. Okay, and uh, uh, last time the story asset virtual gray was uh, kidnapped uh, before we managed to uh, get to the boat. So this time we are looking for virtual gray. Uh, we have uh, Randall Carter in our deck and uh, we are starting from the moon forest. So let's see how Skits does and let's get started. Okay, we are ready to begin. So uh, Doom on Skits' card represents the alarm level. So we start in alarm level uh, one. Some cards correspond to the alarm level and the higher it is, the harder stuff gets so we probably want to try and keep it low or get rid of it all together but we'll see so just doing a quick shuffle to my deck before i draw my opening hand uh let's see so one two three four five Uh, we get Randolph Carter, Thieves Kit, uh, Well Connected, and two Unexpected Courages. I don't think I need Randolph Carter immediately. So we'll keep these. And well, well I'll, I'll try to fish for something else. So three cards, another Thieves Kit. Well, that's not good. And uh, well, Lucky and Fast in Bargain. So. I think we are getting our economy going fast enough, but I was hoping to see Lola Santiago immediately or the Black Fan, so it is what it is. Um, well Connected is really good, um, that's good to get into play immediately. So, quick shuffle to the deck and we're ready to begin. Okay, so there's an ability on this location, the Moon Forest, where we start action test agility 5 to hide among the strange trees. If you succeed, reduce your alarm level by 1, limit 1 success per game. During your turn, except during another action, evade. If you fail, raise your alarm level by 1. So we can do a fast evade here, but if we fail, that's not good. But we'll see, so... Mm. I think uh, I'll do my uh, skits ability first, so I'll spend three resources. Then 
I will test three versus three to try to double those resources. And uh, cultist is uh, reveal another token. If you fail and your alarm level is higher than your modified skill value, after this skill ends, draw the top card of the card. Well, it isn't. So let's see. Uh, we will draw another token. Elder sign. Well, uh, we will actually succeed in this test. So we had the lucky in hand, but we don't need it. So we actually gain six resources from that, which is great. Uh, that was a fast action. Then we will uh, let's just do two actions next. We'll play thieves kit and we'll play well connected. And last action. We will investigate with the thieves' kits. Or... Uh, we are investigating... Yeah, we have the lucky, so... so we spend one to investigate. Uh, we are five versus... No, we are four versus four. No point in committing well-connected, but we have the lucky, so let, we'll see. Skull is X axis half of your alarm level rounded up, so it is a minus one. We are failing, but I'll play the lucky. To succeed, we grab the clue. We also get one resource from the thieves kit. So that is our turn. No enemies will go to upkeep. We get the money tax level two and gain a resource, so that is the first round, let's go to the next round. We add a doom, one of five, first encounter card of the game is Corsas of Leng. So, spawn the nearest city of surface location, so this is unfortunately a surface location, so it spawns on us immediately. So, not liking that we get uh, an enemy immediately before we are really set up so I think this round I'll just do an easy skits resource test to just get the well connected working and it is a minus one because that's a skull so we succeed we'll gain one resource then uh, we are evading this guy And uh, we will use the well connected for these chests. So evading six versus six versus five. Yeah. So if we fail, this uh, this guy hits us, but lowers its um, evade value by three. So uh, six versus five. Skull. So minus one. We evade. So this guy is evaded. We can. Get away from it. We'll just start moving. Let's go around uh, this way. Uh, Temple of the Moon Lizard. Uh, three Shroud, one Clue. Uh, test Willpower 5 to hide inside the Forbidden Temple. If you succeed, reduce your alarm level by one. After you discover any number of clues at the Temple of the Moon Lizard, you must either take that much horror or discard that many cards from your hand. Well, uh, we can take one horror. That's not that bad. So last action, we will uh, use the thief skip to investigate five versus three. Zero. Uh, we'll take the horror. We don't want to lose any of our cards. We get that clue, and that is our turn. Uh, we'll go to upkeep. He's ready. We draw a card. Twenty-one or bust, and we gain a resource. That is that round. Oh yeah, we gained a resource from the Thieves uh, kit success, so we have seven. So that is that round, let's go to the next round. We add another Doom and count the card. So this round is Deep Slumber. Revelation, put Deep Slumber into play in your threat area. You ma your maximum hand size is reduced by three and is checked after each time you draw one or more cards. 
and double action this card gives lumber well we probably just want to play stuff so uh, first action we'll just move over to the city of the moon beasts oh yeah we need three clues so we can advance soon enough so city of the moon beasts uh, shroud is axe and axe is the highest alarm level among all investigators so one uh, fourth at at the end of the round, each investigator at the City of the Moon Beast tests agility to each investigator who fails must raise their alarm level by one. Okay. So we'll use the Thief's Kit to investigate. Uh, five versus four versus one. Minus two. We'll get, generate a resource, get this clue. Let's see where. VP somewhere, so only investigator at the City of the Moon Beast uh, may spend the request number of clues group to advance. So we'll advance immediately. So choose an investigator at the City of the Moon Beast to take control of the set aside virtual prey. Uh, story asset check catalog if Randolph was captured. That card's owner puts the set aside Randolph Carter into play. Well, Randolph what? Not captured, so we'll get virtual prey into play. So, in this scenario, virtual prey says uh, reaction after your alarm level is raised. Either draw a card, gain one resource, or heal one horror from virtual prey. If there is more than one investigator, there isn't so need for the rest of that. Last action. I think we will just... Okay, so we need one clue. So, exploring the moon. Objective only investigator at the Temple of the Moon. Uh, Blizzard may spend the required number of clues to advance. So, we need one more clue. So, let's just move to Dark Crater. Uh, two Shroud, one clue. So, test so we'll, uh, Intellect 5 to fight within the crater. If you succeed, reduce your alarm level by one. A force at the end of the turn, if you are at the dark crater and have discovered one or more of, of its clues this turn, uh, test uh, will power three if you fail, raise your alarm level by one. So we won't be doing that this round because we don't uh, get the clue from here. Uh, no enemy actions, we'll go to upkeep, we draw another Faustian bargain. Oh yeah, we forgot to do the skits test this round, but it is what it is. We gain a resource, so I'll just uh, upgrade these to a fiver. So we have nine resources. So, and we... Yeah, we drew a positive card. Yeah, so that is that round. Let's go to the next round. We add a doom. 3 of 5 and counter card. So this round is close watch. Test agility 4. If you fail, you must either discard the asset, discard the asset you control with the highest print of cost or raise your alarm level by 1. We are uh, 4 versus 4. Don't have that many agility cards. Uh, we have a. Uh, I doubt I'm playing the 21 or past, so we'll. Use that to boost. We'll also use we could actually do first the skits uh, skits own ability with one resource. Uh, three versus one and not commit this to the test. Skull is a minus one, so we succeed, we get Couple resources, we have five more. Oh, I mean, ten. Okay, so now we are using the post here. The 21 or bust, and well connected to this test. So we are four, five, six, seven versus four. Another skull, so we pass, so we don't have to discard anything or raise our alarm level. <clears throat> First action. 
we will investigate this location. Uh, investigating four versus two. Minus four, so we fail. Well, that sucks. We'll try again. Uh, tablet is a minus one. If you fail, raise your alarm level by one, so we succeed. But now we need to get out of here. Uh, we'll move to City of the Moon Beast. At the end of the round, each investigator to City of the Moon Beast. Well, that's at the end of the round, so. No enemy actions will go to upkeep. We draw a card. We get Lola, that's great. We get the source. We test uh, test on there, so we are two, uh, four versus two. I will use well connect for this, so we are six versus two plus one. So we didn't need that well connected, but we don't raise our alarm level. So that is that round. Let's go to the next round. We add a doom four of five and count the card. So this round is. Moon Beast, so 5 fight, 5 health, 1 evade, we are evading, <laughs> we are not fighting this, uh, retaliate, boss at the Moon Beast enters play, raise each investigator's alarm level by 1, after you defeat Moon Beast, reduce it by 1, so we'll add 1, this guy's uh, engaged with us, so we'll mark it like this. So our alarm level raised, so I will yeah, unexpected courage. So first action, we will evade this guy, and we are five cards in hand concerning this card, so we're not over our hand limit. So uh, evading four versus one. Uh, cultist reveal another token. Skull is a minus one still, so we succeed. Uh, this enemy is evaded. Second action, we'll move here and advance. Uh, through the center, so put the set aside cavern beneath the moon, dark side, and the black core locations in the place zone. Spawn the set aside moon lizard at the black core exhausted. Shuffle the encounter discard pile into the encounter deck. Okay, so we get uh, caverns beneath the moon and the black core. And that's the dark side, so we can move there from here. Or from here. And uh, we can't enter here before clues are removed from here. So, last action, we will actually, before that, I will spend three resources. I'll just put this here. Uh, Testing three versus three, and we'll commit the unexpected spirit. So we are four, five versus three, zero. Uh, we'll get so we get three more resources. So one, two, three, which we will spend immediately on our last action. Two. Play Lola Santia. So that is our turn. Uh, we'll go to upkeep. These enemy readies are well connected readies. We draw a card, another money talks, and we get the source. So that is that round. Let's go to the next round. Uh, we add another Doom, so we advance the agenda. Oh yeah, um, before that, this guy spawned here, exhausted, but is ready now. So we'll mark that enemy 
this. Okay, so this uh, agenda advances. Uh, shuffle the encounter disc. Oh yeah, we should have done that already. Uh, shuffle the encounter disc or bind the encounter deck and e raise each investigator's alarm level by one. And uh, we will draw a card with that. The black fan. Great. Uh, with the virtual gray. Our alarm level is three. So this guy has a hunter. Moonlizard can only enter cave locations. While Moonlizard is engaged with an investigator axis, that investigator's alarm level, otherwise uh, five. So this is uh, three, four, three. The alarm is raised, so we have a threshold of five. We need to get going. Okay. So we still need to shuffle this. Not many cards in the encounter this purple yet, so we'll see. Okay, now we have a better agility to um, get past the moon beast. Okay. Encounter card to this round is hunted by corsairs. That's it. Hunted by corsairs to the current act. When the ad advances, each investigator takes two damage. Just take the damage. Next round. Okay, so we, we need to do is to, if each surviving investigator is at the black core and it has no clues on it, advance. So we need to get to the black core and get the clues off of it. Okay, first action. We'll move here. This guy engages us. We will evade. Actually, let's back up. We will play the black fan. Uh, first, we'll do Skitz's ability. And uh, let's do it. How do we want to do this? Okay, so we'll commit one of the money talks, so... So, uh, we turn it into a resource test. Your base skill value for this test is equal to the half the number of resources in the resource pool rounded down. Okay. This is the worst level. I'll try that. Let's see. We'll do this. Well, we don't need to draw a card at this moment, so we'll do this. this. Uh, 5 versus 2 uh, Minus Was it rounded down? Rounded up, so minus 2 So we still succeed We get the uh, two clues Which uh, we will spend uh, two of To get the black fan into play And uh, I think we will just play a Faustian bargain to boost the black fan up. So we'll get two uh, curse tokens into the chaos bag, unfortunately, but we'll gain five resources. So now we actually have an extra action from the black fan, which we will immediately use to... Well, this, this might uh, hurt us in the long run, but we will just play the other Faustian bargain. Another two curse tokens, but we have plus one to all of our skills, so that, that's really good. And that is our whole turn. No enemy actions. Well, this hunts here, but can't remove, uh, move further. Uh, we'll uh, ready, draw a card. Hyper physical shotcaster, and we can restore, so that is that round. Let's go to the next round. We add another Doom, and count the card for this round is 
deep slumber, so our hand limit is dropped by another three. Well, I think we're pretty set up, so we don't care about that. So... We will move here. Uh, this guy now engages us. We will evade. And I am using the well connected. No. I, I forgot I have four actions. Let's just ignore this guy. We'll move here. So this guy engages us. Second action. We will evade and use the well connected. So we are. Uh, five, six, seven, eight, nine versus five. Tablet, we pass, so this guy is evaded. Third action, we'll move to the caverns beneath the moon. So, six round one clue. After you fail this uh, skill test uh, while investigating caverns beneath the moon, until the end of the turn, reduce its round by two. Well, we just uh, use six of our risk. No. First, we will evade this guy. So, uh, this is Hunter. We'll just evade uh, 5, 6 versus. We have 4, 5, 6 versus 3. Uh, curse! Oh, well, oh dear. So, we need to. Oh, no. oh dear, oh dear, so we are failing, can't help that, minus one, well, at least we got two of these out, okay, well, that sucks, but it is what it is, so, uh, then we will just uh, spend six resources, no, we will save that for next round, okay, so, enemy phase, this guy hits us, both 2 damage and 2 horror. Upkeep, uh, we ready, we draw. Offer you cannot refuse. I will lose 5 resources. Okay, well, we lose our plus 1 to our skill test, or, or our plus one from the black band to our skill test, but it is what it is, so we gain a resource. Uh, that is that round, let's go to the next round. So yeah, this ready, so we can use it next round. So, let's go to the next round. We add a doom, and count card for this round is uh, Moon Bayaki, nearest surface location. So, uh, this has alert hunter. Uh, pray highest alarm level 3 or more only. Alert Hunter while moving or engaging Moon Bayaki ignores investigators with an alarm level of 2 or less. So that is the nearest service location for us, I think. We need to get away from this guy. Okay. First action. We will... Evade. I am evading 5, 6, 7, 8. I'm actually doing the skits ability. Two resources. I am committing uh, this. And. Uh, Let's just hope we are high enough. So we are four versus two. So tablet, we succeed. We get two resources. So we have again plus one from the black fan. So uh, now we are evading uh, five, six, uh, four, five, six. 7, 8, 9, 10 versus 3. Uh, 
Actually, we don't need this. Uh, six versus three. So minus two, we succeed. This guy is dead. Uh, second action, we will save our resources and use well connected to investigate with the thieves kit. No, we'll just investigate. Uh, nah. Let's not use the thieves kit. Uh, we will just fast grab. No, we'll lose the action. Yeah, we'll investigate with the thieves kit. Um, yeah, that is the last token on thieves kit. But we have another one. Uh, we are investigating. Uh, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, versus 6. Minus 4, but we still succeed, so we grab one uh, resource, we'll grab the clue. We will move to the black core. So now that there are clues, we can move here. Okay, Shroud is X. Uh, X is the number of depth tokens in the black core. For after the black core is revealed, Place three resources on it. Uh, as the depth tokens plus an additional three depth tokens per investigator. So there is six. Uh, action test. Uh, willpower two or strength two to swim through the dark lake at the moon score. For each point you succeed by remove one depth token from the black or We probably will just. And uh, last action. Oh yeah, we'll have to advance first. So this uh, gives us two damage. As we advance to the other side, put the set aside cavern beneath the moon light side, light side of the moon, and the white ship locations into play. Oh yeah, if it has no clue, so yeah, back up. Uh, we will investigate and I will make this um, resource test. So we are investigating uh, 10 versus 6. I'm just double checking. So level 2 has the difference of um, drawing a card. So we are 10 versus 6. I'll just mark uh, the depths like this. They so have 6 resource tokens. Uh, minus 2, we succeed. We'll grab this clue and now we advance. So now we put the set aside. Shift this guy over here. Caverns beneath the light side, a bit crowded, and the white ship. Oh, yeah, we succeeded with draw card 21 or bust. We are not over our hand limits. Now, objective find a way off the moon. So, again. We need to hustle next round. Okay, so the mystery ship can come that you board until the person moon be separated. If you cannot enter, uh, okay, so we don't have an alarm level of five or more. That's okay. Okay, uh, that is our investigation phase, and this guy hunts here. Uh, nothing else happens. This guy readies. Uh, we draw a card, and uh, I get rid of the 21 more past. And we gain a resource, so... That is that round. This ready is... Let's go to the next round. Uh, we add a Doom. Uh, three of 
5 and count the card is close watch. Test agility 4. If you fail, you must either discard the asset to control with the highest cost, which is the thief's kit. So we'll just test this. Uh, we are 6 versus 4. Auto fail. Well, I, I don't really care. This is discarded. It's useless anyway. Okay. Uh, investigation phase. First action will move to here. So. Six trout, uh, one clue, and the same text. If you fail here, we lower the trout by two. So the path to the moon surface is long and winding. You cannot enter the light, uh, light side of the moon while caverns beneath the moon light side has clues on it. So I will just uh, buy this clue fast with Lola. And keep on moving. So move uh, fast, move five shroud, one clue, and a victory point. So we will actually play the thief skits. And lose one action. That work it. Yeah, we might as well. But we'll do the skits ability. Commit this. So we get one action back. So. Minus one, we succeed. So we are back to 50 <laughs> resources. We get an extra action. Which. Uh, So we'll investigate using the thief skits. We are 4, 5 versus 5 and we will use money talks to go 8 versus 5. Minus 3, that's enough. We'll get the resource. We'll grab the clue that was there. And that is our turn. Enemy face, this guy hunts here, this guy hunts here. Upkeep, we draw a card, we ready, and again a resource. That is that round, let's go to the next round. We'll add a Doom, 4 of 5, I think this is the last round of the game. And counter card is Somnophobia Test. Uh, intellect 5 for each point you fail by, take 1 horror to a maximum 3 horror. Okay, we'll commit this, it comes as 1. Uh, we are uh, two, three, four, five, six versus three. Zero will pass. Okay, first action will move to the white ship. Okay, after the white ship is revealed, put the set aside captain story as it is to play at the white ship. Okay, so the captain has. If each undefeated investigator is at the white ship, parlay, test, uh, willpower, or uh, intellect three, because our axe is the highest alarm level amongst investigators. So we will start testing. So actually, we want to raise our monies up by. That's a, uh, we'll, we'll take a resource. We'll spend two resources as a fast action. Uh, we are testing three versus three versus uh, two. Uh, cultists, okay. Three versus two still. Elder sign. Okay. We'll grab. Uh, yeah, let's just grab money talk level two. So we are 
up to 20 resources, we will call a, uh, make it a resource test, so we are testing uh, Ten versus three, and it is a minus two. So we pass. We draw a card. Another money talk. So we get to advance. Okay. So the captain. Resolution one. So we got managed to get off the moon quite easy with uh, with skids having. Uh, so much resource generation. Okay. Uh, in your camp log record, the investigators traveled to the cold wastes. In your camp log record, Randolph survived the voyage. Uh, each investigator and experience equal to the victory but X value of each card in the victory display. Uh, we got one, two, three, four. No, we could put five, six. Yeah, we got six experience, which is enough to make some good uh, upgrades. Then, uh, record three tally marks next to the evidence of Karad in your camp log. So now we have, I think, ten. I need to check. Uh, then we need to play uh, next uh, scenario 3D, point of no return with uh, Ra uh, Roland continue to the interlude tree, the great ones. But that was uh, parallel skits in the dark side of the moon scenario. Uh, we did quite well. Uh, the resource generation, even without the lone wolf, was good enough to get the black fan rolling. So really liking this uh, deck. So hope you guys like this playthrough. Thanks for watching. Uh, until next time.